Hello everyone and welcome back to the TPA Vlogs YouTube channel where today everyone we're back playing Planet Coaster and we're back in the Vintage Park. Of course we're in episode 7 now. We've already done 7 episodes of this park and I cannot believe that we spent 8 weeks building this and the result has really paid off. All of you have really so far been loving the series. I'm so glad you've all tuned in today because we've got a, a very fun episode we're going to be putting in this chairlift ride as you see in here I'm putting in some of those support structures I do change them later on as I don't think they look the best like that so I do change them and we also put a few other flat rides in this episode and of course previously before this episode we've been working on putting in the oriental area so that's been going on for the past two episodes episode five and six and now we're back in episode seven working on this chairlift ride I've said from the start I wanted to put a chairlift in and I'm so happy that we've got seven episodes in. We're probably around halfway through this series now. And so a lot's been happening this week as well. Aside from Planet Coaster, a lot has been happening. I've, I've started tr doing a video every day for all of you. That's going to stick and stay like that. I'm going to try and upload as often as I can now. So I've been trying to go with it for every every day this week. And that's that's you know that's 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 been consistent, and I'm really happy that we've been doing that. So that's kind of how it's going to stay from now on, as uh, regular uploads as soon as we can. I think that there was a bit at the start of this year on the YouTube channel where it was where I didn't upload as much as I should have, but now I want to get back this year, fresh new start, and we're going to be uploading pretty much every day of this year, and we're going to be getting many vlogs for all of you. So that's something that's been happening on the channel. Of course. Back on Monday, the, the video on uh, my channel would have gone up on Wednesday, but I had a lovely little chat uh, with Sean, who of course owns Lift Hills and Thrills, and we had an amazing chat all about my Saw the Ride recreation, of course, that went up on Monday, that video of that. But yeah, I had a fantastic nice little chat with him, he's such a nice guy, and yeah, definitely go check out that channel, that I uh, no, definitely go check out that video that I uploaded on Wednesday. And you can go find all his links in that as well. But yeah, here we are, adding in the nice little station building there. This is kind of one of those buildings which I wasn't the happiest with, so I, n I don't know if I'm going to change it off camera. But I did spend quite a few hours today, around th three or four hours, just doing this whole episode. Um, that's kind of the, the average time we spend, of course. Normally, uh, yeah, I would spend around four, f three or four hours uh, on each episode, which isn't too bad, obviously. We had it when I was, as I was saying, we were having a chat about my Saw the Ride recreation. That's the longest I've spent playing Planet Coaster um, ever in in one go. I obviously I spent, sat down, spent around eight hours uh, all in one day building and recreating Saw the Ride, and that was that's kind of a that was kind of a big project. And of course, as I mentioned, that's going to be the next series of Planet Coaster on the YouTube channel. We're going to attempt to recreate the whole of Thought Park. So. That's kind of what I'm going for at the minute. Not sure if we're going to do it. We might even end up having to do just the separate roller coasters, seeing how it goes. Of course, there's limitations of what you can recreate, but that's kind of what we're going to be doing at the minute. That's kind of the whole goal I'm trying to go for when recreating Thought Park. So, yeah, we'll have to, definitely have to see. Of course, as I said, with this series, we're around, uh, we're around halfway into this. There's going to be around maybe six or seven more episodes. Maybe less, maybe more, not too sure yet. We've still got a fair amount of the park to complete, but the majority of this park has been finished already. So when, when, you, when you see on this, you see me sometimes zoom out. That's kind of just showing you. Also, I get to look over, but there you go. That's a nice little shot there. I'm here I'm just planning out what I'm going to be doing in the next episode. That little space there is going to be uh, for a new flat ride going in. When I say a flat ride, it's going to be a dark ride. So that's a little bit of a hint of what you can expect next episode, next Friday. But definitely stay tuned for that. Definitely come back and watch that watch that episode. But yeah, this week, as I, as I was saying before a minute ago, lots has happened this week. Uh, of course, I did a few different videos uh, on Alton Towers. I did uh, f how to beat the queues this year. I've been uh, when I go to the when I go to Alton, I try and pick up a few different things of what I do and how it that's that, how I can easily implement that in just making the most out of my trip at Alton Towers. So definitely go and watch that if you haven't already. Go and see out, go and check out that video. It can really help you out when visiting the park this year. 
But yeah, here you go. I'm adding in loads of different plants along the queue line. And I've started, throughout this, throughout this series, I've started getting a lot better, I think, with building, putting in plants and scenery. And that's kind of really what I wanted to, you know, learn throughout this building this. And I think when building Thought Park, I need to have the right skills to be able to put that together. And I think throughout this series, I've managed to gain a, a fair amount of skills, especially to be able to build Saw the Ride that quickly in eight hours. When you think about it, yes, that's quite a long time to do it. But when recreating a ride in that high amount of detail, it's not actually that long. Uh, spending, you know, editing, uh, putting all the different details in, working on the indoor queue line, indoor show scenes. And, you know, overall, I'm really happy with how that project turned out. It was, a, it was an amazing achievement to be able to, uh, you know, complete, being able to talk to Sean on his channel about it. Uh, he, he's such a nice guy. Definitely go check out his channel, as I was saying. Um, but, yeah, I think the hard work has really paid off. All of you have been saying so many nice things about it on the YouTube video that I uploaded back on Monday and also on social media as well. So if you haven't already seen my recreation, definitely go and check it out in the video uh, that I uploaded on Monday. You'll find that on the channel recently, and I'll even leave a little card in the top right hand corner. Uh, but yeah, here you go. Here's the second half of the chairlift. Of course, you have to do two different stations, so uh, the, you know, the ride can rotate and go round and head back to the original station. So. Uh, I, I, you, you can see here it doesn't look right what I'm doing. I go back and edit and completely change all of that, don't worry. I didn't really like the look of how I'm doing it now. But yeah, this is kind of uh, kind of coming up around three minutes left of the episode. I'm trying not to have Planet Coaster episodes around 17, 15, 17 minutes. I'm trying to have them around 10 minutes uh, now uh, on each episode. So that's kind of what I'm going for. It can be quite... Um, exhausting talking for around 17 minutes in a whole episode and it's still nice to just even see all of that what I've done in that short amount of time 10 minutes and it's actually an enjoyable experience sometimes when you're sitting down it kind of drags out a little bit sometimes when I was doing them for the full 17 minutes so now you get to experience them see that watch them for around 10 minutes and that's uh, that's a much more enjoyable experience I think for all of you and when I was watching back at my own planet coaster videos I was saying I was saying to myself when I experimented with that uh, for one episode, I was like, yeah, let's keep it around 10 minutes. And that's what I'm trying to do with most videos now. I've got another video coming out tomorrow, which is around 9, 10 minutes. That's kind of the length that most videos are going to be. Of course, if they're kind of short on my POVs and just a few little quick news updates. But the majority of them are going to be around uh, maybe 8 to 10 minutes. So... But yeah, that's yeah. Overall, I'm really happy with how the channel is, how the channel has achieved over the past year. I really want to do a sit-down video talking all about the channel. Uh, and of course, we're coming up to the one-year anniversary in May, so we're going to be going on a big theme park. Uh, you know, getting a big theme park vlog out for you. Probably heading over to Thorpe Park, uh, as uh, that is kind of my home park and one of my favourite parks here in the UK. But yeah, as I was talking about park trips. We're, we've planned, as I said, we've planned our summer road trip that we're going to be going on this summer. Depending on COVID guidance, I think we should be able to get out and go and visit some of the UK parks. We're going to go on a nice road trip for two weeks, going to get many different vlogs from different parks from you. And actually tick off quite a few coasters on my list and tick off quite a few parks as well. But of course, as I say in every Planet Coaster video uh, recently, that we've also booked our trip to Disneyland. Uh, Walt Disney World, sorry, over in Florida. Looking forward to heading there. That's an absolute dream come true. And I cannot wait to visit that park over in Florida. Of course, we're going to be going to Orlando, Bush, Bush Garden, Sea World. Um, and it's going to be an absolutely fantastic trip. Nice family trip with my nan, uh, granddad, mum, and brother. So, yeah, it's going to be a lovely trip. And I can't wait to go on it. But, yeah, coming up to the end of the episode now, you'll, you'll see me here just putting in these last few little flowers around this queue line. But it's crazy seeing all this work sped up when I'm talking to you about it. I don't actually realise, oh my god, I've spent that long working on it. But yeah, that's it everyone for this episode. Thanks everyone so much for tuning in. Really does appreciate it. If you've made it this far, definitely do leave a comment down below saying that. And I need some name suggestions for the chairlift and these two other flat rides that I've put in this episode. But everyone, thanks everyone so much for watching. Remember to subscribe, leave a like, and you've been watching TPA Vlogs. And I'll see you all in the next one. Goodbye.